I once loved the last, and I loved her so well that I hated all others who spoke of her. But now she's rewarded me well for my love, for she's gone to be wed to another. When I saw my love to the church go. The bride and bride party, they made a fine show, and I followed on with a heart full of woe. For now she is wed to another. Was there in the church? I heard the priest cry. Allah, oh, so far, I bid ye draw nigh. And thought I to myself, I've a good reason why. But I have not the heart to forbid it. When I saw my love sit down to dine, I sat down beside her and poured out the wine, and I drank to the last who should be mine, but now she is wed to another. The they ask it of me How many strawberries Grow round the salt sea And I ask them back With a tear in my eye How many ships say Go take me a grave and get said deep and cover it over with flowers so sweet and then I Turning for to take a life sleep, and maybe in time I'll forget that. So they dug him a grave, and they dug it so deep. And they covered us over with flowers so sweet. And now he has turned in for to take his last sleep. And maybe by this time he's forgotten. And 
the king has been a poor prisoner, a prisoner lying in Spain, and well he owed the wind free, as Lane Lang with his daughter attained. What troubles you, my daughter dear? You look so pale and wan. Oh, have you had any sore sickness? Or yet been sleeping with a man? I have not had any sore sickness, nor yet been sleeping with a man, but it is for you, my father dear, for by them sailing in Spain, cast off, cast off your very brown gown. And stand naked upon the thing that I may can you by your shape, whether you be a maiden or name. So she's cast off her very brown gown and stood naked upon the thing. Her haunches were round and her apron was short And her cheeks they were pale and wan Oh, is he a lord or a duke or a knight Or a man of birth or fame Or is he one of my sir man that's lately come out of Spain. He is no lord, nor a duke, or a knight, or a man of birth or fame, but he is willing to win I could bide no longer my lane. So the king has sent for his merry men all, his merry men thirty and three. Say, bring me only all his free, for hang it, he shall be. And when he came, the king before, he was clad in the red suit. His hair was like a strand of gold, and his cheeks were as white as milk. It is no wonder, sir. My daughters love you as well. Had I been a woman as I am a man, my best fellow you would have been. And will you marry my daughter, Janet, by the truth of your right hand? And will you marry my daughter, Janet, and be a lord of the land? Yes, I will marry your daughter, Janet, by the truth of my right hand. Yes, I will marry 
but I won't be Lord of the land. He is mounted hard on a milk white steed, and himself on a dappled gray. He's made her a lady of as much land, and she would ride. I saw made milk a bull fi man fi. I saw made milk a bull who's the fool now. Saw made milk a bull every stroke a bucket full. Thou art well drunken man who's the fool now. I saw the hare chase the hound fi man fi. I saw the hare chase the hound who's the fool now. Saw the hare chase the hound forty miles above the ground. Thou art well drunken man, who's a fool now? I saw the mouse chase the cat fi man fi. I saw the mouse chase the cat, who's a fool now? Saw the mouse chase the cat, saw the cheese eat the rat. Thou art well drunken man, who's a fool now? I saw the man in the moon fi man fi. I saw the man in the moon who's the fool now. Saw the man in the moon about an ox and Peter shoon. Thou art well drunken man who's the fool now. Martin said to his man fi man fi. Martin said to his man who's the fool now. Martin said to his man, fill up a cup and hide a can. Thou art well drunken man, who's the fool now? Decided some pleasure for her to take, and so she asked her mistress, Could she go to the wake? Nelly to the loo, Nelly to the loo, sweet lovely Nelly to the wake, she did go. Now Nelly said, Her mistress, I'll have you to take care of that young lad Roger, I'll have you to beware. So Nelly, you may go, but this promise you must make, don't frolic with young Roger coming home from the wake. Nelly to the loo, Nelly to the loo. Sweet, lovely Nelly, to the wake she'd have gone. So dressed in her best, young Nelly did repair, and as she expected, young Roger, he was there. They danced and they sang, they had beer, ale and cake And all kinds of pleasures that you have at the wake Nelly to the loo, Nelly to the loo Sweet lovely Nelly to the wake she did go And 
And when the week was over, they homeward made their way Until they came to a new cock of hay Then Roger kissed young Nell and her promise she did break She frolicked with young Roger coming home from the wake Nelly toodaloo, Nelly toodaloo Sweet lovely Nelly to the wake she did go Seven months been over and nine been gone She became the mother of a fine lovely son I'll call him, she said, I will call him the mistake I'll call him after Roger coming home from the wake Nelly toodaloo, Nelly toodaloo Sweet lovely Nelly to the wake she did go
across the hills the sun has gone astray tomorrow's cares are many dreams away the stars are flying your candles dying Yield up your darkness To old John Green Yield up your darkness To old John Green But my Master in the night are one All things are equal when the day is done The prince and plowman The slave and free man all find their comfort in old John Green. All find their comfort in old John Green. Homer trust. Eat now your blankets and your feathers. Home is the rover, his journey's over. Yield up your night time to old John Dreams. Yield up your night time to old John Dreams. Across the hills the sun has gone astray Tomorrow's cares are many dreams away The stars are flying Your candles die Yield up your darkness to old John Green. Yield up your darkness to old John Green. Both man and master in the night are one. All things are equal when the day is done. The prince and plowman, the slave and free man, all find their comfort in old John. I'll find their comfort in old John the Green. Now as you sleep, the dreams come waking clear. The hawks of morning cannot harm you here. Sleep as a river flows on forever, and for both man to the John dream, and for your both man to the John. My 
my ears are thirty four. The prairie is my native place, not far from Baltimore. I came upon a sparrow, but now they're lying low. On many a pleasant day I spent in the glen of Avalon. My father died, I closed his eyes outside our cabin door. The sheriffs who were there the day before, and then my loving mother and sister three old souls were forced to go with broken hearts from the glen of Avalon. For three long months in search of work, I wandered far and near, and then went to the poorhouse door to see my mother dear. The news I heard near broke my heart, and yet in all my love, I blessed the friends who made their graves in the land above. Beer up, home, and kiss, and kin, now it's plenty all around. I starved within my cabin, and I slept upon the ground. But cruel as my love was, I dare her shifted no. Till I joined the English army far away from us. Rouse up their says the corporal, you lazy Irish hound. Why don't you hear you sleepy dog the call to arms on? Alas, I had been dreaming of days long, long ago. I woke before to bath the fallen of the night. I groped to find my mother, good how dark I thought the night. But the last of God, it was not dark, it was the broad daylight. And when I found that I was blind, my tears began to flow. I longed for even the pauper's grave in the glen of a
Akamal ye loyal heroes wherever you may be. Don't tire with any master till you know what your work may be. Don't tire with any master all from the clear daylight till the dawn. For you never will be able to pull out the rocks above. Ah, me shoes, they are well worn, and me stockings, they are thin. And me heart is always trembling, a fear that I'd give in. Oh, me heart is nearly broken, all from the clear daylight till the dawn. And I'm afraid I'll never be able to pull out the rocks above. Ah, be cursed and you, Sweeney, you have me nearly robbed. You're sitting by your fireside with your doujin and your gob. You're sitting by your fireside, all for on the clear daylight till the dawn. And you never will be able to pull out the rocks above. Ah, rise up there, oh lovely Sweeney, and give your horse some hay. And give him a good feed of oats before you start away. Don't feed him on soft turnips and take him down to your green lawn. And then you might be able to pull out the rock. Above. I wish the Queen of England would write to me in time and place me in some regiment all in my youth and prime. I would fight for Ireland's glory all for on the clear daylight till the dawn. And I never would return again to pull out the rocks above. <laughs> Thank you.
fox who went out one chilly night And he prayed to the moon for to give him light For he'd many, many miles to go that night Before he came to the town oh, Town, oh, town oh. He had many, many miles to go that night before he came to the town, oh. At last he came to a great big den Where the ducks and the geese were kept therein A couple of you will grease my chin Before I leave this town, oh. Town, oh, town a couple of you will graze my chin before I leave this town. Oh. He and grabbed the grey goose by the neck and he threw the duck across his back. And he didn't mind their quack, quack, quack and their legs all dangling down. Oh. down. And he didn't mind their quack, quack, quack And their legs all dangling down Then old Mother Twiddle Twaddle jumped out of bed And out through the window she stuck her little head Saying, oh, John, oh, the grey goose is dead The fox is away to his den Oh, den Say, oh, John, no, oh, the grey goose is dead. The fox is away to his den. Then John went up to the top of the hill and he blew a little blast boat loud and shrill. Oh, says a rainer, I must be away. I'm many, many miles from my den. Oh, den. Dan, oh. oh, says the rainer, I must be away. I'm many, many miles from my den. Oh. So the fox went back to his cozy den, where the little ones there were eight, nine, ten. And they never had such a supper in their life, and the little ones chilled on the bones. Oh. Bones, oh, bones, oh. And they never had such a supper in their life. And the little ones chewed on the bones, oh.